Hello, greetings to you all our viewers. My name is Alice Muyama. I am here at Apollo Hospital with my grandson, Jairus Nkerewe. Um, we are from Uganda in East Africa. We came to Apollo Hospital on 27th um, July this year. Uh, Jairus had a challenge. I remember I was here last year uh, for a bone marrow transplant, which procedure went on very well, and we went back home successfully. And uh, the progress was very steady, we thank God. But somewhere along the way, around May this year, again he got a challenge, and uh, his bone marrow was hit by some virus and we really had a shock <laughs> we really didn't know what to do but we contacted our doctor dr gaurav Karia here in apollo hospital and he advised us to come back we were counseled by the doctor he told us it happens but once in a while maybe in, in 10 years we had to come down and we left them to do the research which was necessary and they handled us again. My main fear was the boy to go through chemotherapy again. I thought he would not make it because last year when they were fighting the sickle cell disease out, it was so hectic. I nearly lost him. But by the grace of God, he came back and he had the chance to live again. We thank God for the way they have been patient with us and how they have handled us. We are so, so appreciative. It wasn't so easy. Our finances were not so good. Our financial situation was not so good. But they really showed us that they were not after money so much, but they were after saving a life. Thank you so much for listening. God bless you. Namaste. Greetings from Indraprast Apollo Hospital, New Delhi. I'm Dr. Kaurav Kharia, and I work here as a uh, clinical lead at Center for Bone Marrow Transplant and Cellular Therapy. Uh, today you met uh, uh, this uh, young chap, uh, I would say, whose name is Jairus. Uh, Jairus is from, from Uganda, one of the East African countries. Uh, so Jairus is a, is, is a very interesting uh, child. I, I should say because uh, he underwent a transplant for sickle cell disease two and a half years back uh, uh, for which uh, he underwent a half mesh transplant and he did pretty well after that. Around two and a half uh, years later, he presented to us again with uh, uh, a bone marrow failure kind of a state and when we looked at his bone marrow, it was suggestive of severe aplastic anemia with 100% donor chimerism. So probably his uh, 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 new marrow, which was from the sister, got infected, got uh, affected by uh, severe aplastic anemia, which is a very common condition. It can happen to anyone. So then we did a second transplant uh, using the same donor, sister is a donor for Jairus. And uh, it was a challenging transplant because of aplastic anemia. He had number of complications. He had fungal infection. So number of complications he had. Uh, but uh, <coughs> his, his transplant course fortunately was, was uneventful and so was the post-transplant course and, and uh, uh, he's, he's going back tomorrow uh, uh, to his native country at around 100 days post bone marrow transplant. So we at Indrapas Tapolo Hospital wish him all the very best in his future endeavors. Thank you.